20 years ago, in the last months of her life, my mother campaigned to draw attention to the horrific and indiscriminate impact of landmines. Britain's Prince Harry is paying tribute to his late mother, Princess Diana, by urging Two, people to rid the three, world of landmines five. by 2025. Prince Harry and his brother, William, were just young teens when their mother was tragically killed in a car accident in 1997. Prince Harry is now 32 and eager to carry on his mother's mission with the help of demining organizations, including the Halo Trust and MAG, the mines advisory group. My mother had been shocked and appalled by the impact that landmines were having on incredibly vulnerable people and on children in particular. She didn't understand why more people were not willing to address the cause of so much suffering. A mother of four young children in San Rafael was so profoundly moved by Diana's life that she was willing to address the suffering from landmines. Heidi Kuhn founded her charity Roots of Peace 20 years ago in San Rafael with her husband Gary. Her dream turned mines to vines, replacing landmines with grapevines or other food crops. They told me recently they were invited to Kensington Palace this year to hear the prince's call to action. It was very emotional for him. You could really see that in his eyes and his demeanor, and it was very heartfelt. Heidi and Gary were so inspired by Princess Diana, they traveled to the same landmine-filled province she walked in Angola. Their work with the Halo Trust saved people and animals. They applied lessons they learned through their Roots of Peace model in Afghanistan. First, remove the landmines, and then help the farmers improve their crop yields for food and for export. 14 years later, it's having a stunning effect on the economy's gross domestic product. We've pushed up the GDP of the country. Our projects impact the GDP, you know, two or three percent. At the farm level, it's, you know, people changing their lives because now they have enough money for education and health. They don't need handouts. Roots of Peace has worked in more than half a dozen countries removing landmines and restoring farmland. They are ready for Prince Harry's challenge in his mother's memory. I think she'd be proud of her son and what he's doing, you know, because this was one of her top causes. We can take the words of her son and in the next eight years follow up on that call to action and eradicate all landmines by 2025. <laughs> It would just be, it would be a miracle. Cheryl Jennings, ABC 7 News. Move it out because a person can actually lift this out.